Going on, everyone. Sam here with Layton Sports Cards. Ripping 23 Top Stadium Club Baseball Hobby. Eight box half case break number 23. Pick your team style. I believe it was Riley must be at least 3K if Jordan Walker was that much. Uh, Anthony K with the White Sox. Uh, Austin P. Tigers. Brandon S. with the uh, Diamondbacks and Cubs. Daryl S. with the Braves. Uh, Derek I. Padres. Giants Very and nice. Athletics. Uh, Fabrice L. Marlins. Frank M. Uh, Guardians, H. Chi Royals, Jacob C. Dodgers, Jason K. with the Phillies, John W. Nationals, Jonathan L. Rays and Rangers, Joseph P. Yanks, Kazuki N. Angels Mariners, Keith J. Orioles, Matthew F. with the Blue Jays, Michael P. Astros, Nicholas S. Twins, Paul T. Rockies, Bowie N. L. with the Pirates, Robert S. Mets, Scott S. Reds, S. Wayne Cardinals, Shigenori U. with the Red Sox, and Talon H. Brewers. Good luck here, everybody. Let's get after it. We got 13 to go in number 24. Second half case here. Uh, all teams are marked out again. Um, well, 13 to go on the next stadium club. What's going on, Spence? Number one and two, trash. Are you? I know. Wow, man. It's coming really, to it's really garbage. Bless us with their presence. It's really garbage in here, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Detroit City needs your needs your help, Spence. Oh yeah. Go 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 help them. Please do. They need you. Please do. Nice little oversized box loader of Jordan Walker, on the rookie. And off we go here, ladies and gents. Come on, please all be forward. Please all be forward. Come on. Yeah. Nice. That is a Viento, Garrett Cole, Triumvirate, Fisk, and B. Craw, Brandon Crawford. Yeah, like that'll ever happen. George <laughs> Robinson red. The Pistons get out of Detroit. I think the Pistons just need help, man. The Pistons just need help, period. Uh, Andrew Vaughn on the black foil. Ship him off to Texas. That was like the joke. Me and my buddies in college did a uh, like a fantasy draft franchise in the show where we all like picked a team and we did a fantasy draft and like managed our teams and played against each other. Dale Murphy. It's like we each picked like a NL West team or something. There's five of us who play each other more. Yeah. And then the big joke every time that like someone sucked and you were gonna like trade them, Jake McCarthy, Red Foil. He's like, I'm gonna ship you off to the trop. Have fun. Have fun <laughs> in Tampa. Yeah, sh send them to the trop. Base, base, base. Whoops. Now, now that that's is the closest a Yoshida. To you. Uh, Jordan Diaz on the black foot. Hank Aaron, Brady Singh. They cost the Lions the playoff. They did cost the play, uh, Lions their playoff game. They really did, actually. Uh, Yelich, that is going to be a Stephen Kwan red. And auto of Connor Capel going to the A's. Congrats, Oakland. Nice. Uh, Kwan Da. Damn, a lot of orders coming in here. Let me thank everybody real quick before we continue. Uh, Derek C. with the Mariners and two in Logo Fractor. Thank you, brother. Enrico with a spot in Logo Fractor. We've got Brian M. with the White Sox in the next one. We've got My T. with the Red Sox in the next one. And we've got Mr. Hobbs with the Logo Fractor spot. So you guys are killing it right now, everybody. Thank you so much on this uh, Monday morning. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten to go on the next one now. Ten to go on the next stadium club. The um, club. That means uh, draft is down to seven. Uh, best is down to seven. A lot of breaks. Logo Fractor's getting closer to under ten now. Going yard of Shohei. And we're going to be down to really just icons and basketball. That's really all we're going to have to worry about today, everybody. So thank you all. Appreciate that very much. Have to, a little bit of Don Russ to worry about. Andre Dawson. Nice one there to 50. That's sweet. Nice little card there for the Expos. That'll go to the Nationals. Tyler, what's up, buddy? Yeah, happy Monday, dude. Happy Monday, happy Monday, everybody. The start of most of our weeks here, Willie Mays. The start of my longest stretch uh, working. Good. Tonight, tomorrow, and, um, and Wednesday as well. Fernando Tatis on the variation. That's sweet, man. Signing some autographs for the fans. Congrats, Dre's. Just want autos in the... Yeah, autos is fine. Uh, Marcus Simeon, that is going to be an auto. Winton Bernard going to the Blue Jays. Congrats on that, Toronto. Winton Bernard. Base, base. A Julio Urias. And last 
pack of Hobby. Luis Ortiz, red and base. On to the next, everybody. Let's do it. You got to Mr. Ichiro. On the oversized box loader. That one's such a cool card. Love the picture they used there. What's up, uh, Jeremiah? How we doing, buddy? Good morning. There, uh, Jeremiah. Uh, triumvirates of Jackie Robinson for the Dodgers. Shoiza and base. Cody Bellinger, red foil. Cody B still doesn't have a team. I know, it's wild. Is he a Boris guy? Is that why? Maybe, yeah. He must be a Boris guy. Because him, no smell yet either. Nope. Those are really the two big ones. No Montgomery either. Uh, orange, there's no Cinder Guard, a 199. I feel like that's going to start happening soon, right? I mean. Yeah, I mean, like, you got to be signed before pitchers and catchers report, I'd imagine. Yeah, like, it's, I feel like those guys want to be on their. Yeah, you want to get settled in and situated, at the very least. Matt Chapman still, too? Oh, yeah, Matt Chapman doesn't have a squad yeah, yet. Yeah, I forgot Matt Chapman's still a free agent. Damn, dude. Honestly, I would, if I'm the Mets, why not bring him on for like a one-year deal, be, the, be our DH, DH for a year. Right? Tommy Henry, or, 2, 50. Or split split some time at third base with Brett Beatty or something. I don't know. The only problem is if you sign Chapman, you pretty much just say you're waving the white flag on Beatty. Because well, you, you're, you're not gonna, he's not going to want more than one year. Asher Colas. I mean, Mauricio is really going to be our future. True, yeah. There true. on that spot. True. If you can get something for Beatty, by all means, do it. Also valid. Also valid. Dontrell Willis, red foil, basically. I'd be willing to throw him in a trade for like a Mitch Keller or mm -hmm. a, some sort of pitcher. There's Freddie Freeman. Yeah, it really is. Josh Smith, black foil. The Boris policy is signing as late as possible, Daniel. Would, would the Brewers Not ever wrong. get rid of Devin Williams? I know they've Probably. Up. I would think now. Albert Pujols on the red foil. I would think now they're, they're just... They've their their whole squad is gone. Everybody, man. The, the GM's gone. The coach is gone. Yeah. They traded, traded Burns. Yeah, I mean. They're just going to reload, I think, now. Dwight Gooden. Garrett Hill. Yeah. <laughs> we'll give you Garrett. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Chase. Appreciate it. Thanks for looking out, man. Appreciate you, bro. <laughs> what, what Detroit needs is another malice in the palace to get you guys, like, <laughs> recalibrated. That'll, that'll Edgar Martinez, Christopher Morrell, Red Foil. And a hey, Jonathan Aranda going to the Rays, rookie auto. Congrats, uh, Tampa. Good stuff there at Tampa Bay Rays. Base and base. Tampa. Uh, the Pasquatch, Spencer Steer, Red Foil, base and base. I, I don't I, I don't mm, I don't know, Jeremiah. I don't yeah. think I know you're I Jeremiah's a Brewers guy, I know that. J Rod. They may compete. In unbiased. <laughs> they may compete for, like, fourth place. Uh, yeah, unbiased. Uh, Patrick G with the Drays. Thank you, buddy. Uh, William W picking up an Icons random hit style. And Derek I with the Cubs in 24. They still have down nine. and D Williams. And yeah, I mean, they still got a good squad. Like, But they're just, like, I think they're going to sell off, man. And losing counsel is huge. That is Mariano Rivera. And they lost their their GM, too. Yeah, and they lost their best pitcher. Woodruff's gone. So yeah. basically you take, Fre uh, what is it, Freddie Peralta, who's, when they had that staff and, and the Adamas, three of them. Right? Who? And Willie Adamas. He's their short side. He's still there, yeah. He, he'd be a piece for a team. True. There's Willie Mays. The, only pro the problem with the Brewers is, like, you take Freddie Peralta, Who's a great? Because Devin Williams is the reliever, right? Am I, I'm not bugging on that, right? Uh, yes, he's closing pitcher. Yeah, yeah. That is Miguel Vargas. I think Devin Williams is the closer. I believe. I believe he is the closer. Red Garrett Cole. The problem is with now you move Freddie Peralta up, who is the probably the best third and third pitcher by a mile in baseball. To he's now your one. Tristan McKenzie, that's the only issue. I would love Devin Williams and like, and Edwin Diaz as like a one-two. That'd be nasty. That'd be crazy That'd be gross. Just get us to the eighth inning. Yeah, and then that's locked down. If you get to the eighth inning, that's it's, locked it's down. And it's up and down. 
That's it. And I hate the Nets, dude, and I would agree with that. He'd be a great piece. I'm sure he's going to get traded, too. Like, I mean, probably, when, we, when we get yeah. to the trading deadline, I'm sure someone's going to be like, we need someone in the pen bad. Uh, George Springer, Eddie Murray, and Otto of Bo Naylor. Congrats on that one there. Guardians, very nice. Bo, don't you know? Noah Naylor. And base. There was a Cano sighting in the uh, Caribe series. There was, yeah. Me and Jake were watching it on Saturday <laughs> here, and Cano was, uh, was there. Byron Buxton. Runzi Contreras, that's funny. He's like, damn, dude. He's still kicking <laughs> still, around, He's man. still going for it. He's, he's, Jace, he's there. see you soon, buddy. Do it, man. Do it, Jace. It is Monday. Blue Bob. Number one trash has got to do the number one trash thing. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Uh, Paul Goldschmidt on the black and white. Nice one there for the uh, Cardinals. I thought Council was like a, a hero for you guys. He was always a, like a Brewers. Yeah, I always thought the guy. I thought Brewers. I thought Council was kind of liked there. I don't. Know, maybe not. My buddy was a Brewers fan, or is a Brewers fan. I don't know if he really liked Council that much. Indifferent. Yeah. He went to the Cubbies, so that's interesting. Soul, what's up, buddy? I don't know how that's not. I don't know how that's allowed. To Yo. be honest. There's Eloy Otto of Davis uh, Martin for the White Sox. That's on that Shy Town. Base and base. I really don't get how that's allowed, to be honest. What? Estudio Ruiz, like, going from a, a. immediately going from a management job from one team in a certain division to another team. Mm -hmm. Like, if. if Boone went to like the Blue Jays. Like that's I don't know how that's allowed. <sighs> well, that's all a fickle sport. Yeah, dude. That is a David Ortiz. <laughs> Unforgiving too. It is. It really is, dude. Like people people are brutal about baseball. It's rough, dude. Yeah. It's rough, man. Fox Rowdy Telez, Red and T Story. Baseball's doing been doing it to people for decades. Keith with the Orioles. Thank you, brother. Um, Stadium Club is down to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 to go on Stadium Club. Really good deals on the teams remaining, too. On Stadium Club. 9 to go on Stadium Club. Second half case after that. We're sold out on Compact. We got like 9 to go around there. That Stadium Club card we pulled so far. That's a Mike Trout, Refractor, Barry Larkin, Luis Castillo. It's got to be between... Oh, we pulled the redemption for the Rainbow Foil Auto of... Um, Acuna. Acuna. Jake pulled the Super Fractor of Josh Young, one of one. For me, that's card I've pulled. Probably... That Pedro I pulled for Vaughn was actually really dope. I can't say I'm surprised when I joined and the first thing I see is Jace talking about Jake Rogers. True. <laughs> the box toppers are dope, Tony. When you get the, the auto ones, they're super hard to hit, but they are clean. We hit a Alonzo one out of, was it number to 13 or something? Matt Swarmer. Number rookie to auto. 10. What uh, was that? We, yeah, Recently? We, yeah, that was like the oh. Oh, like first or second day we were opening it. Interesting. Who, who ripped that? Kyle I think or? it was Forrest. Oh, Forrest did? Okay. Because yeah. Kyle hit a Votto. Votto oversized, too. Yeah, auto as well. Ooh. Yeah, I'm trash then. Anthony Rizzo, Triumvirates. Morning, Vaughn. How we doing? What's going on, Vaughn? Went to the Pro Bowl yesterday, everybody. Oh, yeah, I heard. Babe Ruth. It was actually pretty fun. With the flag football and all that? Yeah. The flag football is fun, dude, because nobody, like... No one's really going Nobody's crazy. like, why do you want to watch your... Like, I would be so pissed if I'm there watching, like, the Ravens and, like, Kyle Hamilton, like... Tears his ACL yeah, nobody on a stupid hit. I'd be, I, I would be so livid at the Pro Bowl. I would, I would be so anti Pro Bowl after that. Like this is so much more like safe. Like everybody's out there. Every, all the players are out there, like enjoying themselves too. It was packed. It was, and no offense, Vaughn. This is not a. This is not a shot at you. The Pro Bowl was more. Packed than the Jaguars Ravens game I went to on Sunday Night Football. More people at the Pro Bowl in Camping World Stadium, Orlando, Florida. 
Jason Veritek. It was <laughs> packed, dude. <laughs> packed. There's a lot of uh, implants here, so I'm sure that people were starving to see some of their players. There's Ernie Banks. Oh, yeah, I was texting Vaughn yesterday. I was texting Vaughn all the funny jerseys that I saw yesterday. Like all the random jerseys. Yeah, it was mob, dude. That is JD Martinez to 199. What was the best jersey you saw yesterday? The funniest jersey I saw yesterday? Um, oh, the one, yeah, the one that you most like. The one that like sticks in your mind. Probably most. like a, somebody had a Steve DeBerg Chiefs like jersey, like shirt jersey, which is just super random. What? All right, sure. Somebody had like a, all the ones I texted Vaughn. Somebody had a Bud Dupree Steelers jersey, which like is like cool was cool like ten years ago. <laughs> Not ten years ago, but like six <laughs> years ago. Uh. Come on, horizontal five feet in the air. Good lord. Julio Urias. There's a Doug Martin jersey. That was pretty funny. There's a guy wearing a LeBron jersey. That didn't make any sense. He was just lost. Um, Poor guy. Who else did I send to Vaughn? Namdi Asamoah. Someone had a Zeke Elliott Patriots jersey. <laughs> like, yeah, there are some weird ones. Man. There are some funny ones. <laughs> Zeke is a Patriot, man. I... Yeah, the jersey? Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Jordan. I'm sure people had a good time, though, yesterday. I had fun, man. Matt Olson. Adley Rutschman, rookie auto going to the Orioles. Congrats, Baltimore. There we go. Nice hit. That's dope, dude. Hell yeah, that's sweet. Get that into a mag. Good stuff there, Baltimore. A Dalvin Cook Jets jersey? Sure. Or a Zeke Patch jersey? God, man. Neither. Dalvin Cook Ravens jersey? Patrick Sandoval? That'd be kind of hard. Uh, Triumvirates of Showhead on the red. A little bit shorter printed on the red. Not numbered or every, anything, though. We got Mr. Brandon S. with the White Sox and Best. We've got Johnny H. with the Dodgers, Rangers, Braves, and Yanks. Nice. All in Stadium Club. Thank you, Johnny H. Uh, we got Bob C.'s picking up the Reds in Stadium Club. And Mr. Jeffrey H. with a Logo Fractor spot. Zachers Lions jersey. Uh, stadium Club, four to go. Rockies, Brewers, Athletics, Rays. Four Damn. to go on the next Stadium Club. Again, everybody, Bowman uh, Chrome University Basketball, super marked down on those teams as well. We are very cheap on those now. Ronald Acuna, the combos are very inexpensive. Some of the lower standalone teams are very inexpensive. And then I took a good bit. USC is still available in bulk. Um, they're on sale. For one of the first times they're probably hitting sale, I would think. Hunter Brown, Roger Clemens, Black Foil, base and base. Red Dansby Swanson, Reed Detmers, Mackenzie, and Will Smith. Will Smith. Uh, Jack Flaherty. Stroman and base. Orange, Matt Walner. 2 one Torkelson, Cody Thomas base auto for the A's. Nice one there, Oakland. Rookie auto of Cody Thomas. Joe Morgan and Steel Walker rookie auto for the Tigers. Nice one there. I know Spencer takes very big offense to that. Congrats on that because I don't think he ever played there. Um, thank you, Ryan. Picking up the Athletics in 24. Down to three to go on that now. Got to get icons filled up here, everybody, too. Eight to go on icons, PYT. Mookie Betts, Triumvirates. Most of the uh, mostly bigger teams remaining in icons. But good chance at some big stuff, too. Alec Burleson. Hopefully we see a cut auto today. That'd be pretty dope. Ooh. That is a Frank Thomas 
refractor on the chrome, red foil of Corbin Carroll. Nice I love, one there. I love those cut autos, man. They're pretty clean. I pulled uh, Bob Gibson the other day. I saw that one. That was cool. That is a John Carlos Stanton, gold minted. Congrats on that one there, um, Yankees. I thought the uh, Ron Santo cut auto was funny because it looked like it was guy? a it was a cut diagonal trading card. Like he signed like, oh, yeah. on top of a card and they yeah. just cut it like diagonal yeah. so they straightened out his auto. Yep. Yeah. But the card itself, the pictures like diagonal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I thought that was, that was pretty cool. funny. I thought that was kind of different. Thank you, Long J. Pick up the Gaddians. Wait, hold on. Let me see them, uh, Stanton, really quick. The one that you're top loading right now when you top load it. Xander Bogarts, base and base. Marlins man is in that far left, he said. Yes, he is. <laughs> he surely is. He was at the Caribbean series last night, too. Oh, my God. Yes, he is. You're so right, Vaughn. He's right there. He's right there, Marlins man. That's good eye, Vaughn. Nice catch. Good man. eye, dude. He definitely is in there. That's freaking great, man. That is so great. <laughs> it was at the All-Star game. <laughs> ah, excuse Bless me. you, Thank sir. You. <laughs> Unreal. Shohei Otani. Unreal. All right. We got Johnny H. with the Brew Crew, Angels, and Cubs all in Bowman's best. Thank you, buddy. J uh, Jason W. has now a couple of random spots tonight. And Mark R. with a Logo Fractor spot. You have to snipe on him, Vaughn. Three to go on number 20 foul. Three to go. Rockies, Brew Crew, Rays. Rockies, Brewers, Rays, everybody. All inexpensive teams. Yep, all $19 yeah. teams. Get in there. That is Brett Beatty. You get a lot of cards, which is nice. There's always a chance on one of those teams, too, to hit one of the short prints. One of the members only, photographer's proof, the 92 throwbacks, all that kind of stuff with a team like that. And they're just cool cards, man. They're just cool cards. I really do enjoy Stadium Club. Freddie Freeman. Let's go. We got Golden Auctions ending in three days now for Joe. Let's go, baby. Oh, yeah. Did you got any uh, anything on your watch list? Josh Gibson. Uh, Josh Gibson will go Pirates, by the way. I do, man. I've got a lot. Pulled, uh, picked up some really nice cards last week, too. Very excited. Uh, highlighted by a Daryl Dawkins auto. Hmm. That was the card I was most, I'm was most excited about getting. Mike Yastrzemski. I think I might just keep that one. Yeah, a couple weeks ago, I picked up a Mike Mussina auto. Okay. Card from 99. Yeah, there's Yankees. Oriole. Oh, yeah. That's straight to the PC. Yeah. Catal Marte. Yeah, I pick up, like, one card a week, generally, that I end up keeping. Like, I picked up the uh, PSA 9 23 Topps Chrome Mookie Betts SP, which is really cool. It's just a cool-looking card, man. Like, all the, there's stuff that I like. Yeah, I'm keeping the Mucina. I'm keeping... I bought a Phil Hellmuth poker card. Okay, cool. So, yeah, some cool stuff like that. I and mean, usually I'll keep, like... Keep one card in order and then just sell the rest. Try to sell the rest, at least. Two to go in 24. Two to go. It's Lou Gehrig, Red Foil. I think that was Mr. Brandon R. Yep, picked up the Brew Crew. Thank you, Brandon. Appreciate you, buddy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, another half case of this coming up right after this. I'll send you a picture of it, Vaughn. It's a clean one. Aaron Judge. That is uh, Jeremy Pena. A little Chocolate Thunder action. Yeah, when I saw it, man, I had three cards like that all on my watch list. I had a Dawkins, I had a Paul Silas auto, uh, Juan Soto, and then I had a Nate Archibald. That is Drew Waters, rookie auto for the Royals. Um, so I had three cards like that on my watch list, and the Silas went really high, the Archibald went really high, too. And then the Dawkins I got for, like, 25 bucks, and I was like, absolutely. Julio Rodriguez, I mean, he's passed, he passed away, like... Six years ago now, probably. Hmm. Yeah, I'll shoot you a picture, Vaughn. It's a really cool one. Uh, black, that was over you. Uh, black and white Torkelson going to the Tigers. Francisco Lindor on the gold chrome, 299. Lindor. Refractor. Nice one there for the Mets, Matt Chapman. Okay, here's a good question, because you're a New York sports fan. Sure. On Michael K. show yesterday, they did, or they talked about, what is, in all of New York sports, that includes Yankees, Mets, that includes 
What's up, Adam? Like the four major sports? Yes. Uh, hockey, but also, hockey yeah. basketball, football, All four sports. baseball. Um, and it would be Mets, Yanks, Giants, Jets, uh, Rangers, Islanders, Devils, and then Knicks, Nets. What is the, right now, currently, what is the Mount Rushmore of New York sports? Like, who are the four biggest stars in the four major sports? Of those, of all those teams, who are the Gunner four? Henderson. There's Stephen Kwan. I want to see what you say. Right now, um, easy two, I can tell you right now, Jalen Brunson, Aaron Judge. Yep, those were the first two they said. Those were the, those were the guarantees. Those are the easy ones. Um, after that, I would, mm, that are still currently playing. Or, Jackie Robinson. Or, or yes, they, all currently playing. All currently playing. And I'll tell you what they said and who they left off and what reasons as well. You're, I think there's one more you might not think of. That is Matt Olson. Nice one there. Because he's not like... He's he's very good. I mean, he's very good. He's very good. One of the best at his position in the sport. But he's also like very personable, very marketable, does a lot of commercials. And that's who they had as their third, and then they were split between a couple for the fourth. That is Jacob DeGrom, Chrome, Chris Sale. Hmm. I need, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Said, yeah. I'm, I'm interested thinking. to see what you think. I'm, I'm going through the roll of decks of yeah, players. Yeah. Absolutely. Nice, Josh Young, Rainbow Foil, Rookie Auto to ten. Seven of ten. Congrats, Rangers. Bang. Hell yeah, dude. That's so cool. Good stuff, Texas. Get that into a mag for you. One of the final teams taken, too. Yep. yep. Let's go, man. Yes, Vaughn, you are correct. It was Saquon was the third one. That is Anthony Rizzo. Saquon? Because they, like, Giants fans love him. He is really good when he plays. But when Mount healthy. Rushmore? For right now, they, they did say that, yes. That is Jordan Alvarez. Uh, I, I, I don't agree with that. I, I don't think so, because, I mean, what's, like, what are the qualifications of throw him just because the fans love him, like? Yeah, fans, like, how much the fans like him, that is a rainbow foil to 25 Lennon Sosa rookie. I'd argue that Brees Hall's got more more fan base in New York I don't think than Saquon. Than Saquon. Uh, not yet. Maybe ask, ask bring this conversation up again in, I don't know, three years? You yeah. might be right. Right now, I'd take one for sure. I don't know. He, on a losing team, too. And then they had, they were split between two for the fourth. There's Kevin Gaussman. Uh, Simeon Woods Richardson, rookie I, auto. I, I want to throw uh, Panarin in there. That was, they said, that's the one I would put as the fourth, personally. Because I'm not even a hockey fan, and I know I know how much of a star Chemi Panarin the is. The Brim, but they yeah. said they don't know how much of a star. Pa like, if you walked down the street, how many people would be able to recognize Chemi Panarin? Nobody. You know what I mean? Nobody recognizes hockey players. Yeah. The only people that you recognize that play hockey are like Sidney Crosby, Alex Ovechkin. Ovechkin. Yeah. Right. Gretzky. May maybe people would recognize Austin Matthews, and he's one of the best right now. Right. Really. So like, like maybe recognize. Yeah. So like uh, Bryce Harper, Ozzy yeah. Smith, and base. He's walking around New York City. No one knows. Harold with the A's and base and not uh, base best had a couple more orders coming. I want to thank everybody really quick um, before we continue on. We had Johnny H picking up the Orioles and icons. Thank you, buddy. Andrew H with the Rocks and the Rays and Stadium Club. Ryan D with a logo fractor spot. We had uh, Ying T with a spot in IMAC and then Harold with the Athletics and best. And I think we had one more order come in here. Uh, it's gonna be Zach D picking up the Astros and Bowman Draft. So thank you, buddy. Appreciate that. Awesome, man. Jason Pierre Pulse. Um, and then they put um, their last two that they were potentially talking about. Tory Hunter would be Garrett Cole and Pete Alonso. And they give they I gave was the thinking of both. I was thinking of I was thinking of both of those guys, but like um, Nick Prada. And they and what about Pete Alonso? They gave the nod. To, they said yes to Pete Alonso over Garrett Cole. He, uh, yes, because he does more within the community There's stuff. He's got, more, he's got more of a face in the tri -state. Yeah, like, like he's, he's literally out there like doing like all kinds of like fundraisers. Yeah, and... he's like he's like funny. He's big on social media. Right. Yes, and like yes. he's he's always like a good guy to mic up. Like Garrett Cole. Like I love obviously love Garrett Cole. But, but he's like he's Gromit. He kind of yeah. He doesn't really do uh, much. Like he's not really super. That's him. Him and him and Pat Mahomes have the same. Yeah, he's got a weird voice, number one. And number two, like, 
Alonzo is overhated. No, I agree. I, he's I just hated because he's goofy. Yeah, exactly. And he's not your goofy guy. Rice and stuff. So, like, I think they gave it to Alonzo because he's more of, like, he's more of a star. Like, they I, also said, like, Jeff Bagwell, that is uh, rookie auto of Bailey Falter. Ice one there for the Phillies. <laughs> Too good, baby face. Um, and Sandy Alcantara. They also gave the, uh, they, they gave that mention to Lindor as well. Lindor's and they say that goal. Lindor is a better baseball player than Alonzo is. Yes. But Alonzo is a bigger star, right. so to speak, yeah. in New York. I, yeah, I didn't want to be biased and say those guys Freeman. as a Mets fan. I think that's fair, though. Those were, those were guys in the argument. So, yeah, they said the Mount Rushmore would be easily, not even uh, not even close, Judge in, in Brunson. In Jalen, yeah. And then they said Saquon would be the next one. I have a hard time putting him in there. I don't know. That's fair. No, I think that's fair. Just Boston, because also both New York Redmond football teams are have been, have been pretty terrible. bad the yeah. last decade. I mean, They've not, not the Giants as much, but, like, they've been pretty bad Drew in Waters. recent memory, so I, I don't know. No, exactly. Exactly. That could all change. Uh, if got one Chris of M. with the Rangers and Icons. Thank you, Chris. Icons down to six to go now, everybody. Hey. Six to go on Icons. That's awesome. Appreciate you. That is a Chrome Anthony Rizzo, Chris Bryant, Black Foil, Base and Base. Uh, very few left in draft. I don't know if there's any left in best, to be honest. Best might be very close to sold out here. Uh, the next one, I believe, is sold out. Compact sold out. Logo Fractor's getting close. Draft's almost there. Best is almost there. Icons is almost there. We really just got to worry about basketball today, everybody. That's it. Jonathan India, that is a Yanner Diaz for the uh, Astros. Nice one there. Congrats on that one, Houston. The Alonzo and Lindor arguments, I can ar almost argue against them because, like, if you're not, if you, if they're not on your team, you don't really like them. So, like, true. Shane McClanahan to one ninety nine. Like. They're both very likable if they're your guys. Right. I mean, they are pretty marketable. Terrible weekend for breaks. We got you, Adam. Mm. Yeah, those are the guys. There's no one really... Yeah. I think that was a good list. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That is a Mark McGuire on the members only. Nice one there for the A's. Yeah. Problem with hockey players is, like, they... They, they're not marketed correctly, so you don't no, know they're not. what they look like or who they are. Right, exactly. Like, because I think Panarin is better than any of those. I mean, maybe not, like, he's not, I don't think, better at his sport than Garrett Cole is. Honus Wagner. Spencer Steer, rookie auto. But I think Panarin, like, in the hockey universe is more of a star than Garrett Cole is in the baseball universe. You know what I mean? Like, because Garrett Cole's great, but he's not, like, interesting. That is a triumph rates of Hank Aaron. Plus, you kind of have to make the, the argument, too, like, you almost want to put more homegrown guys in there, too. So, like, True. you know, Cole was great elsewhere. He won a World Series elsewhere. Mm -hmm. Ryan Sandberg. Alonzo was, you know, drafted by the Mets. No, I uh, totally agree, Vaughn. The Jalen Brunson is one of, like, the best signings in history. Dude. It honestly is the best Brunson. signing in Nick's history. Ken ever. Wallachuk. It's got to be, man. That, there's... I don't. I mean, I'm, I've been a Knicks fan my whole life. There is no other signed free agent for the New York Knicks that is better than the Jalen Brunson. Yeah, I would, the only one I would maybe argue is Carmelo Anthony, but that was a trade. That was so a trade. Yeah, not. and then we gave up the the it's house, for him, yeah. the whole. We gave up our arms and legs for that guy. We should have just waited just until he was a free agent at the end right, of the year. Right, because then it's like it never worked out because they never won anything. Exactly. Was it wasn't like one playoff series. Yeah, exactly. We would have had a crazy team if we just like were patient. We would right, have had right. Wilson Chandler, Channing Fry, yeah, Ray Felton. Danilo Gallinari was in that trade. People forgot about him, but he could have hit a couple threes for us in, in the long run. Uh, Red foiled Alex Thomas, base and base. Uh, yes, um, uh, Daru. He's they're over on Fanatics Live. They're over on Fanatics Live now. They're still streaming, still streaming breaks. Uh, Chris D with an icon spot. Keith G with the Mets in icons and the Mets in TC Black. Keith, thank you, buddy. Um, all right, let's go ahead and do this recap really quick, everybody. How's Ben Simmons not in this conversation? Yeah. Yeah, Adam. Yeah. Uh, we got Spencer Steer, Ian Diaz, a Bailey Falter, uh, Simeon Woods Richardson, Stephen Kwan, Drew Waters, Steel Walker, Cody Thomas, a uh, Matt Swarmer. Davis Martin, Bo Naylor, Jonathan Aranda, Winton Bernard, Connor Capel, Sami Henry. That is a base auto of Adley Rutschman.
for the Orioles. And then a rainbow foil to 10, Josh Young. That'll do it for the break, everybody. Thanks again for the fill. Coming up next is number uh, 25.